Let's go exploring with Daniel Cook right here on the Veritable Quandary. This is Daniel Cook making a clay dragon. Hi, I'm here with Lisa, and today she is going to teach me how to make pottery. Hi, Lisa. Hi, Daniel. How are you? Good. This is Daniel Cook on a bike, in a plane, on a farm, playing games with many places and friendly faces. Daniel Cook. And Daniel, this is my daughter Maya. Hi. Hi. Say hi. And today we're going to make something out of clay. I think I'm going to make a dragon. Okay, so let's let's start with some clay. I'm going to get both of you a piece of clay, and I want you guys to try and roll it up into a ball. Okay. Okay. What do you think it feels like? Mm. Yeah, it's kind of soft. Very and hard mud. Like mushy, kind of like stuff. mud. Only very hard mud. I want to make a dragon like that one. Oh, like this one? Yeah. Okay. Wow. With the spike on his head. With the big spike on his head. Yeah. Okay, so you know what we should probably do? We need to make a few balls for the different parts of the body, okay? You know what, Daniel, I forgot. Maybe we should put on our apron before we start to get all dirty. Okay. okay. How are you attaching the tail of the body? Well, I'm getting my fingers a little bit wet, and we're gonna just smooth it on like this, see? Can you watch like that? I don't wanna put tail spikes on them. You could probably put some spikes on them now if you want on the tail. You wanna put some on? So what you would do, yeah, is just squish it on we might make that might be a bit tall, so we'll just take it down a tiny bit, okay? So you okay. can just, with clay, you can just mold it, take things down, take it apart, change it, whenever you don't like something. How is Maya doing? How are you doing, Maya? That looks good. And yeah, she's making a butterfly. So we're doing the wings here. Here's the body. And what's that? The head. That's the head, okay. And um, what that else? That looks we... good. It does look good. Looks a lot like a butterfly. It does, doesn't it? Well, it might a lot of very, very complicated. So we're doing the head, so we could do it like this, or we can use the top of our fingers and roll it. I'm gonna give him a flat head. Or you want him to have a flat head, okay, all right. Should we try attaching his neck and his head? So yeah. how did you want his head to be, like this? Actually, I want, I want th like, like this. Flatter, right? Like. This is the upper jaw. Okay. Like a crocodile. Okay. See, like this? Like that. Oh, I see. Okay. This is Daniel Cook making dragon wings. So here we go. Wow. So this we rolled out with a rolling pin ahead of time. It's nice and nice soft. Nice and smooth. It's like it's hardened. Yeah, you know why? Because we let it dry a little bit, so it's a little harder and a little easier to work with. Do you want to draw it out, or do you want me to draw it out? Okay. Okay. So maybe look at this guy here, the one that we have, and sort of just, yeah. Mm -hmm. I like my dragon's rings long. Okay. Ooh, we're getting long. Now we're starting to look like a dragon. So now we're finished. So let's choose our color so that we can paint it. Do you want to do that? Okay. Okay, Daniel, so what we're going to do is we have to let this dry for about a week, and then we're going to put it in our oven, and then you can come here and pick up your dragon. Does that sound good? Okay. Let's go bring it over there. Let's just see what it's like. So what we would do is when this is dry, we won't put him in now, we have to let him dry. We'll take him off this board, and then we'll put him in the kiln. Is there actually fire in there? No, there isn't. This is an electrical kiln, so it just gets very, very, very hot. All the coils on the inside, they all light up and get really hot, and the kiln goes to about 2,000 degrees. Well, I'll, Great. I'll come in a week. All right, we'll see you then. Yeah. 
Hi, Daniel. Hi, Lisa. Is my dragon ready? Let me check if it's ready. Wait here okay. and I'll be right back, okay? Let's see if it's cool. Yeah, we have to see if it's cool. Look Ooh. at your dragon. What do you think? He looks cool. He looks great. Thank you very much, Lisa, for teaching me how to, how to make a clay dragon. It was, it's very cool. Well, I had a lot of fun too, thanks. And please come again, all right? Okay. All right, I'll see you later. Bye. Bye, Daniel. Tell Mara I say hello. I will. This episode is over, but the very best of my collection is banned on YouTube. To see what you have been missing, go to archive.org and search for Gyro Screw Loose, and I'll see you there.